Good morning, Finley River. Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, let me scroll back up here. We're going to finish up the book of Galatians with uh, Galatians chapter 6, 18 verses. It's all one subject package, just like chapter 5 was. I hope that you've enjoyed this. We're just going to see where God takes us uh, tomorrow. And uh, maybe I'll get some comments from some people as to uh, the direction we're going to go. Really hope you've enjoyed uh, the day to ride. Chapter 6, verse 1. Brethren, if any of you is caught in a trespass, you who are spiritual, restore such a one in a spirit of gentleness, each one looking to yourself so that you are, you too will not be tempted. Bear one another's burdens, and therefore thereby fulfill the law of Christ. If anyone thinks he is something when he is nothing, he deceives himself. But each one must examine his own work, and then he will have reason in boasting uh, in regard to himself alone and not in regard to another. <clears throat> For each one will bear his own load. The one who has taught the word is to share in all, good, all good things with the one who teaches him. Do not be deceived. God is not mocked. For whatever a man sows, this too he will also reap. For the one who sows to his own flesh will from the flesh reap corruption, but the one who sows to the Spirit will from the Spirit reap eternal life. Let us not lose heart in doing good, for in due time we will reap if we do not grow weary. So then, while we have opportunity, let us do good to all people, and especially those who are of the household of faith. See with what large letters I am writing with my own hand. Those who desire to make a good showing in the flesh try to compel you to be circumcised simply so that they will not be persecuted for the cross of Christ. Those who are, are circumcised do not even keep the law themselves, but they desire to have the, you circumcised so that they may boast in your flesh. But may it never be that I would boast except in the cross of Christ through which our, the world was crucified to me and I to the world. For neither is circumcision anything nor is uncircumcision but a new creation. And those who will walk by this rule, peace and mercy be upon them and upon the Israel of God. For now, from now on, let us let no one cause trouble for me, for I bear in my body the brand marks of our Lord Jesus. Grace of our Lord Jesus be with you in with your spirit, brethren. Amen. Paul basically sums up this chapter by telling us just to serve one another. I want to go back up to verse four and share with you a thought. It says here, but each one must examine his own work and then he will have reason for boasting in regard to himself alone and not in regard to another. The thing is, is that when we, we examine our work of what we've done, what God's done through us, it's going to show us that God is the one who we are going to be able to boast in. When we boast, Paul says down here, um, But may it never be except that I boast in the cross of our Lord Jesus. We're, when we boast, it should be boasting about what God's done for us and through us and giving God the credit for everything that gets done and as, and as we serve one another. Sums up this whole chapter by saying, serve one another. I pray that you guys have a great day. Had a great service yesterday. Hope that you to get to see you guys uh, on Tuesday evening, tomorrow evening, and I look forward to seeing you again on the daily ride. Let me pray for you as we begin our day. Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your many blessings. We praise you. We exalt you. We lift up your name, and we ask you to help us to have opportunities to serve each other. We love you. We stand in need of your touch today, and we ask that you bless those that we come in contact with 
as you have blessed us. We love you, we love you, we love you, and we're so thankful that you love us. And it's in Jesus' precious name that we pray. Amen and amen. Hope you guys have a great day today. I love you. God loves you. And I hope you'll continually follow our, our daily ride. And I hope you'll keep riding.